upgrade your smartphone with Appalachian Wireless, get $300 off selected models. Capture memories, stream, and stay connected with the latest technology. Visit one of our stores or AppalachianWireless.com right now. Recently, the Pikeville City Commission amended a current ordinance that should help clarify open carry laws in the city. Weapons may be allowed in someone's personal vehicle, but not on school grounds during a school-related function. Mountaintop News spoke with Pikeville City Attorney Rusty Davis to learn more. Basically, what we have done is uh, amended our policy to better explain what laws are out there, what, what ones we allow. For example, we clearly provide that uh, people can have weapons in their, their vehicle in a parking lot. We also let the public know that uh, there are times when our athletic facilities are basically leased or under contract by uh, different high schools for use. So we just trying to let people know when they can or cannot have firearms. There are not any city regulations. We're just telling them what the state and federal laws are that we're required to enforce. Um, so everyone will know what's expected of them. As a reminder, the city of Pikeville does not make laws for the public to follow, but merely adopts state and federal laws. For those interested in becoming more familiar with city ordinances, the statute numbers are made publicly available online. In the ordinance, we even put the statute number. So if you want to further go and read, look up on the internet, the state or federal statutes, you could do that. But it gives people an outline of, of uh, what's expected where they can have firearms. Like, you know, you can't have them in police stations, you can't, you can't take them in the post office. These aren't the city's rules. These are rules that either the state or federal government has made that we all have to uh, follow. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.